आज ही डाउटनेट ऐप डाउनलोड करें डाउटनेट पर होगा अब आपके सभी मैथ्स केमिस्ट्री फिजिक्स और बायोलॉजी डाउट का सफाया बस अपने क्वेश्चन की फोटो खींचो उसे क्रॉप करो और तुरंत वीडियो सोल्यूशन पाओ डाउनलोड नाउ हेलो स्टूडेंट लेट स्टार्ट विद क्वेश्चन ये वी हैव गिवन इफ एक्स इज इक्वल टू साइन टी वाई इज इक्वल टू साइन ऑफ पी टी देन प्रूव डैट वन माइनस एक्स स्क्वायर डी स्क्वायर वाई बैटी एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस एक्स डी वाई बैटी एक्स प्लस पी स्क्वायर वाई इज इक्वल टू जीरो ओके सो लेट स्टार्ट विद द सोल्यूशन नाउ फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल हेयर वी हैव गिवन द टू थिंग्स दैट इज एक्स इज इक्वल टू साइन टी ओके एंड सिमिलरली वी हैव गिवन वाई इज इक्वल टू साइन ऑफ पी टी ओके y is equals to sine of pt and we have to find this expression now first of all what i will do i will differentiate both of them differentiating both with respect to t okay so what i will get i will get dx by dt will be is equals to sin t is nothing but cos of t okay d it's a derivative okay and similarly dy by dt will become is equals to cos of pt into derivative of pt will be nothing but p okay now what i will do i will simply say uh, dy by dx will become is equals to dy by dt divided by dx upon dt so it will become cos of pt into p divided by cos of t okay now let this is equation number 1 now what i will do i will again do the differentiation on both side here i will say differentiating on both side okay so what i will get i will get here d square y by dx square Will be is equals to and by using v upon v formula, I will differentiate it. So first common cos t will be common. Derivative of cos p t into p uh, means p is the constant that we no need to be take a derivative. So it will become out and the derivative of cos p t will be nothing but minus sine of p t into derivative of p t will be p minus sa uh, cos of p t will be common. okay then derivative of cos t will be minus of sin t okay and divided by divided by v square okay so v square means cos square of t now if i will uh, rearrange this equation so it will become d square by by dx square okay here we left one thing that is if we are dividing it by x so here one thing will become that is dt by dx okay because all the terms are in t okay so here the expression will become p in bracket this minus sign okay now this term i will take to that side and this minus sign minus sign and this minus sign will be get plus so here it will become sign of t into this cos pt okay cos of pt minus sin uh, p okay p into cos of t into sin of pt okay and dt by dx okay so dx upon dt is cos of t so dt by dx will become 1 upon of cos of t so here in the place of this i can put 1 upon cos of p uh, cos of t okay that will be cos of t okay now here in this uh, denominator what was that that is v square that is nothing but cos square of t now i will take cos square of t to that side so the expression will become cos square of t into d square y by d x square will be apply this p to inside so it will become p sin of t into cos of pt and i will separate the denominator that is this cos t because cos square t that i have taken out to that side so it will be remain cos of t minus this p into p will become p square into cos of t into sin of pt okay divided by 
cos of t now this cos t cos t will be get cancel so what i will get now in the place of this cos square t i can put 1 minus sin square t because 1 uh, cos square t is nothing but is equals to 1 minus sin square t, uh, t okay so here i can put 1 minus of sin square of t into dy by dx d square y by dx square will be is equals to now this p uh, will be as it is and here so okay cos pt i can common here cos pt upon cos of t into sin of t okay minus this p square will be as it is and here it is sin of pt now i will put the values over here what is sin t sin t is x and sin pt is y so here i can put 1 minus it will become x square d square y by dx square will be is equals to p now cos pt upon cos t is nothing but dy by dx we have formed in equation number one okay so here i will put dy by dx into sin t is nothing but x minus p square sin pt is y now i will take all the things to that side so expression will become 1 minus x square d square y by dx square and this will go to that side become minus of p uh, dy by dx and this will become plus okay here x will be there plus my, uh, p square y is equals to 0 and this is what we have to prove look at here this is what we have to prove 1 minus x square d square y by dx square minus x dy by dx plus p square y is equals to 0 and here we have proved okay and hence proved okay so here is the solution i hope you like the solution thank you class 6 to 12 se need iit je means or advanced ke level tak 10 million se zyada students ka bharosa aaj hi download kare doubtnet app ya whatsapp kijiye apne doubts 8400400400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 400 